guys. It is 7.55. I'm going to head downstairs for breakfast. Today we have our wine tasting and I'm very excited about it. Uh, last night we went to dinner. We went to Coupe de Cour, I think is what it was called. Um, apparently one of the uh, winners from Top Chef a couple of years ago. That's his restaurant. So we went there and had a four course meal, um, which was good. It was a good experience. So did that. And now I'm going to go downstairs for breakfast and um, get dressed for the wine tasting because you have to be slightly more formal. I am just wearing this to go downstairs and eat, but finish and finish my makeup because I kind of did it, but I didn't dilute like lipstick or anything. Because we're going to go eat, so there's no point. So I'm going downstairs to get some breakfast and then come back up. We're going to head out around 9.30 to do the wine tasting. And then I'm free for the rest of the day. So I'll probably tour the city again and you guys can come along for all of that. So this is freshly squeezed orange juice. They have a machine that squeezes it. It's amazing. Croissant is nice and flaky. Eggs are delicious, ham is delicious, cheese is alright. And then we went upstairs to the library too. Oh, I have a bit of there. Oh, library. It's like a little miniature Beauty and Beast. Oh my gosh. Yes. I had to come back to the pavilion, which is like their garden area. I don't know if I'm zoomed in or not, but the garden with the villa, there's the villa. I want to take some pictures, so that's what we're attempting to do. Bonjour, salut. I'm just getting a little lost, but in a good way. Just wandering around. Sometimes it's good to wander around, and I feel like this town or city is a good place where you can kind of get a little lost because all roads lead back to where you're going. So just head in the direction of where you're trying to go, and you'll find some place new. So we're just wandering around. I don't know what road I'm on, but it's nice to just kind of wander a little. One of the roads. Very aesthetically pleasing. It is kind of warm. So I'm just trying to walk in the direction of shade in all honesty or with the sun to my back. Oh, wine tasting was good. Didn't share that with you guys. I had two different kinds of Chardonnay and two different kinds of Syrah. And Syrah is a red wine if you didn't know. So now I'm just walking around a little. <laughs> this pizza. I've heard that the slices of pizza here are really good. Come, ugh, come to find out, uh, Axon Provence is actually Roman based for the most part. So I was trying to figure out why there was so much Italian influence in it because it's uh, founded by Roman people and then they kind of expanded outward. So. That was pretty cool. I was trying to figure out why I couldn't find any French food. It's all Italian based, like pizza and pasta. And that's the reason why, for anyone who's wondering. store and I'm very excited I'm coming back tomorrow they're closing but I got a little sneak peek but I'm definitely coming back tomorrow to try the butter bear this is where I was 
decide to have dinner because they are the closest to French cuisine that I want to try. So, we might splurge today. I'm back and I'm a little oily. I'm ready to take this makeup off too. So, unfortunately, the restaurant that I want to go to only takes reservations, but they were really, really nice. They really were. They were really nice. And he told me um, that tomorrow they are open for reservations because they're usually full. Like, they're full today and they're full Sunday. And Sunday is when we leave. So, he said they were. They had some openings for tomorrow. So, I went in and booked uh, for dinner tomorrow at 7. So, I'm very excited about that. And so, I went in and did that. And then I just kind of got discouraged from eating anywhere else because I really wanted to eat there because that's where French food can be found. Um, so I just reserved for tomorrow. I did on the way have some pizza, as you guys saw, and the pizza was really good. Surprisingly, I did not expect it to be good, and it actually was. Um, like I said, this city uh, has Roman roots, so there's a lot of Italian influence as I found out, um, so there's a lot of Italian uh, food like pasta and pizza and any pasta and all these things. So I might try something tomorrow. I'm going to do some research and I'm going to try a place for lunch tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to try to do the whole Parisian thing. Not Parisian. I keep saying Parisian. I'm so sorry. I'm going to try to do the um, whole French thing. I want to go to their uh, little fruit market and get some cherries because I've been staring at their cherries since I got here. I can't figure out the kilograms situation like our metric system in the U.S. did not prepare me for Europe. So I want to do that. I also want to go to the markets and take you guys along with me. So I'm going to get up early, grab breakfast, um, go to the market, do that whole thing. I want to dress. So I'm going to try to find a dress, but I'm going to go to the market, have lunch, come back here, hang out, may shoot some content. I don't know yet and then go out for dinner later so that's the plan you guys can be along for that I also found on the way there I'm gonna sit because I want to eat my food I found a Harry Potter store which is insane and I told the young lady because they were closing I told her I'd be back tomorrow they have a Harry Potter store and they're playing the Harry Potter music. I got some clips because I wanted to show you guys. Um, but it's kind of tucked away. You wouldn't have been able to see it if you didn't know what you were looking for. Ooh, I'm going to have some tea as well. But it's kind of tucked away. If you didn't know what you were looking for, you wouldn't find it. But it's literally like an owl and owl and the lightning bolt and... Harry Potter's glasses, and when you go in the store, it's all things Harry Potter. It was an amazing find, and if I was a true Harry Potter geek, I would have bought several things. Um, but it was pretty good, and I don't have a fork, but I washed my hands. Wands, the egg from the Triwizard Tournament, all kinds of things, so... Oh, oh, I am going to get their butterbeer. They had butterbeer in the store, and I'm going to go buy some. That's the true reason why I'm going back. I should have um, put my reservation for lunch, but that is all.